Be part of the show by calling in at 888-565-1470 or while watching them on amp2.tv, join the chat room. And now, here's Santori and Sons. And good evening, Boca! Boy, I tell you, today has been one of those days. It was a technical nightmare, but we got the final roundup of tonight's show, and then we can go watch the Heat lose to Indiana. Oops. Not a big Heat fan, as you know. But tonight's show on the Freddy Fixer Show, Santori and Sunstar, we have a special guest. Man that I met a few weeks ago and been doing his uh, live stream on WWNN 1470 Radio, Alan Knight. Thank you. It's a pleasure. Alan, that Thank mic that mic yeah. doesn't work too well. Because you'll be on the floor. It. You'll yeah. be on the floor if pretty soon well, if you keep going. This is a test. I love. Well, I have. Uh, there's a piece of tape on the. Uh, Why is there the a piece of tape on it? Because otherwise it will fall to the ground. And there it goes. It's going down. That means that's the Viagra mic. You know that. Well, at least get duct tape. Duct tape's at least. You know, the, now the way the way to an extra dollar. The way to work that mic is you hold it straight up like that, like and then, that? yeah, okay. and, and then bring it down, yeah, you, the, and then it'll stay up. Like how about if I just pull this out and use it like this? Well, there you go. <laughs> How's that? <laughs> that works. But so now you look like the well, entertainer in the night. Oh. Hey, is it working? Yeah, you can hear him. I can shout. <laughs> there you go. The real show starts what at seven forty-five. This then is just a test. This is We're the test. testing everything. That's right. No, it's a pleasure being with you. Thank you. Always wanted to do a show with uh, with Alan. Some of his stuff on Wednesday night we uh, tape you seven to eight, uh, and then it replays again on. You make it uh, extra special. Yeah. So thank you. No, it's it's fun just being here. And you replay. If I have a mic that works. That would be extra uh-huh. extra special. Mm-hmm. You have your lovely other half. Well, thank you, Bridget Day. Yes. That I call Doris Day. Oh, that was funny. I, I, you know, I don't know how that happened. Well, when we, what, what uh, Freddie is talking about when he does the, um, the what is it on the screen? Yeah. If you're looking, okay. Yeah, the split screen. And it said the the night and day shore. Yep. Instead of the night and day show. And and the first part said eight six six five, and that was it. It wasn't and the rest more of people the saw number. that one than any other show. And they wanted to know where the rest of the number was, probably. Yeah. Well, you know what it is when you do those flubs it on purpose like I misspelled but you know they, that's when they remember it even more I know they seem to love that so, so we have to do more as that we'll call her Doris Day and you Alan Thick of the Night you know what you can do try turning up the volume on this mic just a bit I know it will kind of and see if that works this oh. is a test okay that may work a little bit better or is it working at all? I don't or know. Try, I'll talk I don't even know. Way. Can anybody hear it? You know, we did last week's show. Nobody heard us. Yeah. I messed up. We were, we what were, we were muted. Yeah. It was a test of the people's. Uh, we have a call. We have a call. No, this isn't working. <laughs> I know. I know. I know you're looking at this. I'm looking at it, but it ain't working. But we actually have a phone call. This okay. has got to be for you. Because I didn't expect any well, phone calls. You, you take calls, right? Absolutely. Oh, okay. This has got to be it. There you go. Oh, oh, my goodness. Wait a second. It is uh, another talk show host in oh. the South Florida area. Oh, no. Talk show host listening who? to another talk show. Who is? Yes. And who, <laughs> is <laughs> who is it? Who is it? I guess this is Craig Worthing. The very oh, infamous okay. Craig Worthing. You're on uh, the Funny Fix It program. Hi. I Why am I introducing you? That's okay. You <laughs> can do it. Yes. Hello. I was told there was going to be a sports show on here, and I thought, my God, I've known Al Knight do music, do talk, but I never known him to do sports, so I thought I had to call in, A, to congratulate you, because your team, the Cardinals, have the best record in baseball. Yes, I'm a St. Louis Cardinal fan. In the uh, National League Central Division, and just so happens that my Red Sox somehow, with that pathetic team we have, is first place in the American League East. For yeah, the baseball they beat the Yankees sports. this weekend, huh? Oh, they well, we yeah. were washed out yesterday, right? Yeah. Yeah. But they were, but they won. What? Yeah, what's the one and a half Yeah, and the, Three and nothing. Nothing. the night before they, they won. I'm watching the Yankees right now with uh, Tito Francona's Cleveland Indians right now. But uh, I imagine if you're going to talk sports tonight, you'll be talking about your eat. Yes. Well, well also, win. I was going to ask Freddie what he thinks about instant replay because there was how many blown calls? Uh, something about the, the Philly and uh, Milwaukee game the other day. Where, where are they going to have instant replay in uh, in baseball? They've got it. No, only on home runs. Hey, you're talking about the the no, home run that was a double. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that one. <laughs> yes. Okay, that the one. The umpires do a hell of a job, and uh, we don't want to make everything. You know, it's all right to have a little instant replay, but we don't want to have uh, 
We don't want to make something that's done by a human being into the technical uh, computer stage today. No way. No, but, no. But wouldn't you want the right call, regardless of nah. bingo? Absolutely. We want, we want the right call. I want the right, the right call. human call. The right human call is not the call right call. The that's why they have instant replay. You know what it is? We're not. You guys are from the computer games, and everything there is. That's too pure. No, that and even in about. video games, they make mistakes, you know, and they no. have instant replay in video games. So. Well, listen, let's talk a little about let's talk a little about Heat basketball. Now that we're going to get into okay. the uh, into this, they thing. may do. By the way, they may in- change and do a little more uh, of the uh, instant replay down the road, but not a lot. They don't it, leave it to the umpires. Well, here, uh, go, let's, yeah. let's go to the Heat. The well, Heat. If you have a thousand, if you have. Um, uh, penalties or whatever, it, half of those are kind of subjective. Yes. You know, so that can make the difference but where you're going to hit those they free have, throws. They have instant replay now on all all penalties. Like, by by um, the way, I'm not an expert, and I know there's other people who want to talk. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, basketball season ended when the Celtics uh, went down the tubes. But you want to <laughs> know what the problem, in my opinion, the Heat has? They don't play like the Celtics. When the Celtics, when they play as a team, and the Heat has to play as a team. And if they're going to win tonight... Wait, you don't like the LeBron show? Wait, I thought it was the big three. When it, no, it, no, it, no, big no. Win. When it, did it get it, the big one? It's only the big one because the last two have had a limp. Yeah, yeah. Well, okay, the big one. Bosh hasn't shown uh, up. Wade well, well, is, is, is injured. You're going to have more than the big three or you're going to lose tonight. There is no there's no big three. It's well, a it's a big one and, and two. The one and change. It's LeBron against Indiana. I agree. Okay. How, how many said people best. thought that the Heat were going to go seven games in this uh, deal with Indiana? I did. You just because I you did. hate the no, Heat. No, 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 no. I don't hate the Heat. You just I said, have you Indiana p- winning it all. Before? Or all. Just, right before wait, they beat the what Knicks. What were you, with a psychic network? No, before? no. You know what it is? When you're 7-2 right. and your whole team is tall, these kids are tall and athletic, it is hard to penetrate. So you better have your game on the perimeter. And Bosch and, and and the other weight, where are they? They disappeared. Well, so what do you do? Also, to? you didn't have the Birdman because oh, the bird he, he was Be- and that's what we were going to get into. It's the replay. Is, looks like a peacock, doesn't yeah. he? Yeah, yeah well, he's, he's just fighting everybody. Well, he's he's Mr. Everybody. Fowler. He's Mr. <laughs> Fowler. And now James wants every call when he drives. He wants to get every call. Oh, he's LeBron James. He, I don't he, care he who thinks he, he deserves is. the call. You know, he's so the best in basketball at this is, moment. Absolutely. But the bottom but, line, but Michael, who's the jo- Michael Jordan got every call. No, no, no. Michael Jordan earned uh, every call. Oh, but the LeBron difference. hasn't earned every call. LeBron, listen. But Michael didn't have to play as like Wade and Bosch around here. What are you talking about? Le- he made these guys. Oh, I'm sorry. You have, uh, what's his name? Mr. Tattoo. Um, the Birdman? No, for the oh, Chicago Bulls. Uh, uh, no. Are you uh, talking about Rodman? Rodman. Okay, okay. Rodman is a whole. Uh, Rodman became a whole about Pippen? On the, He became a player under. Yeah, but these these players developed. I'm just saying, you can't compare the two teams. All right, when when LeBron turns the Birdman into a good player. And you got my vote. When he turns any of those other guys minus the what, two. What happened to, here, this is going to date me. I, I don't know how old you're, uh, Freddie. But Am I still on? Yes, you're still. Do you remember Wilt Chamberlain? Yes. Yes, yes. when he uh, went up against the Knicks, the Lakers and the Knicks. That Willis type Reed? of player anymore that has, what, what's that, Craig? I just want to say one thing and I'll get off. I, I want you to continue talking about the Heat. But if you want to talk about a surprise team, Look at my Boston Bruins, who are surprising everybody. Yeah, you beat my you beat my Rangers. I'm not happy about that. <laughs> and we've already beat Pittsburgh one game, and in, in Pittsburgh, three to nothing. Yeah, and they're playing now. I'll say goodbye. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. I'm yes. gonna tell you, Boston Bruins may end up winning it. Really? They may end up winning it. I tell you, when they beat the Rangers, I, I even I know the Rangers stunk, but they have a good goalie in Boston. They're what? playing what? out of their minds. Right the now. collapse. What happened to the Florida Panthers? Where they Florida were, Panthers have a team? Well, they wait a second. Just last year, they made it to a game seven in the playoffs, and then what happened? Now it was like unbelievable. They just co- totally collapsed. Hockey should not be played in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> the, the ice is not warm. <laughs> it's too warm. Well, okay, you have a better franchise with the uh, Panthers or a potential than you do with the uh, the Marlins for baseball. Well, that's Look now that. the Marlins, unfortunately, what a fiasco that is. And, you know, you took my Reyes. That was my favorite player. Yeah, they got rid of him. 
They got rid of everybody. Well, that's what, nobody the, left. that's what the Marlins are famous for. They build a team and they sell it. They've done that before, absolutely. Yeah, and they won the World Series doing that. They beat the Yankees. That's right. Now that they have a new home with, what, four people and the popcorn vendor. And have you been there? And it's expensive. Place. Yes, I've been, uh, we actually, I have tickets next. Uh, I'm taking off of work here. I have <laughs> uh, tickets uh, on the uh, the 15th to see the Cardinals. Oh, okay. Okay. Cardinals have a good team. They're number my, one. You got, my, you got my other... Good well, player. the Cardinals have been successful the last you know decade. And, yeah. Well, because of their farm team yeah. and, and raising. What do you have with the Marlins? Nothing. They don't have a farm team. Well, and they, the Cardinals they buy also good brought players. in some players. Look at they got the uh, the guy who played for the Mets, and they got the third baseman. Okay. And you got uh, and you have Pujols. So you're doing this without Pujols, which is pretty. Impressive. Oh yeah, that was well. He was asking too much money. I mean, just well, one guy. He you was Mr. Amer- you like LeBron, but you don't like Pujols. Well, well basketball's only five players on the court at one at time. At one time. I agree. <laughs> so you can, you can spend a little bit more on one player, and he can you can still be successful. Listen, and and baseball, baseball's it. nine players, and they all have to bat, you know. No, no, no. That don't and they all have to play See, you guys make it so convenient. And you need pitching. So so, there's a lot of players. You, there's a lot of factors in baseball. A lot, a, lot than, a lot more variables than, than basketball. That's right. But, you know, sometimes in baseball, it isn't how good you play, but how bad the other team plays, which goes for every sport. Yeah, but more variables makes the more the game more complex. Okay. So, you know, the, so big, the big uh, thing that everybody likes to watch here, that what is, it's not, it's NASCAR. Oh, Na- don't get me started. NASCAR that? season. That's a little what about, what about drag the... race? I saw that this weekend. I said, what is this? NASCAR is pretty It's pretty hot stuff. Yeah, like, oh my God, of how they market that. They love to see cars go round and round and round. It's not, it's I, not, I it's not about watching. the race. It's about everything that goes around the race. You know, the they have, fighting. Not, not just the fighting, but no, they, have, back they have to hockey. <laughs> they have parties in the in the center of the, you know, while the cars are going around. They're having a big party in the middle. Yeah, but when you're doing racing, you don't do that. But now what they're doing is they're having the, ra- the, the drivers fighting with, with each other, throwing the helmets at one another it's so it's like become, it's become hockey. so you want to see that okay <laughs> i like that they hey, get well, out of the cars and beat the crap out of what each is other. that sport where it's uh, like two guys are in in the, a fenced in area and they oh, just UFC? beat the crap out of each other you have, uh, oh the UFC. cage fighting yeah. okay what is that that's like just uh, fighting like uh, <laughs> caged animals I, i'll give you a funny story linda Harmon had never seen that before and we were watching it and she came in and says what is this abusive thing what is, this is ridiculous take this off Next thing you know, she's screaming at the guy, hit him! Hit him harder! See, what, Break his what nose! What does that say about a, a refined society that we have? We like Here's violence. The, <laughs> yeah, absolutely. But the it's Romans, the Romans used to love seeing parts all over the, the Colosseum was, you know. Well, football is becoming very physical, right? Football's I mean, been physical. I don't absolutely. know where you've been. Yeah, but you got a freight train now. You got a guy that weighs 240, 50 pounds of sheer muscle running the 40 and 4. Coming at you like a bullet, yeah, but they want them faster and bigger. The equipment can't even keep up. These are like bodies. buildings. Yeah, <laughs> th- these are these are titans going up against each other. But when this the, is the impact happening. they make, you know, when they hit each other, well, it's football, just tremendous. Football, I predict, is going to have to go to a some kind of helmet that's this big. You know, it's huge. We should just put them in bubble wrap. That is it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they're getting physical. Do you, do you watch uh, the Golf Channel or the Fishing Channel? Yeah, or I, yeah, like I watch. That? How can you we, we started learning how to play golf. And I, I like miniature golf. Hitting it in the castle. Hitting it in the windmill. I, I actually skill. played miniature golf a couple weeks ago. Alan, have you ever played golf? No, not real golf. Miniature golf. No, real no, golf. Hit it, no. But never. first of all, it is the most amazing thing in the world that a little ball can go so far. This guy is You can't even see the Wait, ball. Wait, you're a good golfer? I'm not a good golfer. No, he stinks. <laughs> but he okay. hits it far. Where it goes, it could go. Nobody in a house. Wait, did that, okay. I've hit road. many houses. I've hit cars. I've hit everything. If you're if you're driving on military at any time in the day and you, your car gets hit, it's probably it's him. probably me. <laughs> it's either him or me. How how many dimples on a golf ball? A lot. A hundred. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Oh, well, that could be a trivia question. Someone, there you go. someone call in. Somebody I'll, I'll, I'll give away a I'll give away a $25 gift certificate to one of our sponsors, Mississippi Sweets. If you know how many dimples on a golf That's ball. That's pretty good. Okay. Every, See, every, every, every golf ball has the same dimples. Uh, mm. uh, up to a certain amount. There, there are some that are a little bit less, but it's well over a hundred. But you know, I, 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 g- I just now. you can't count them. Yes, you can. You the can. little dimples. Yeah, on the, he uh, can't even count to ten. So. <laughs>
Lord. <laughs> See what I'm going to put up with? And you think you have it tough on your show. Oh, I, well, I like the, the opening, the uh, Sanford and Son, because uh, Red Fox was where I was from, St. Louis, Missouri. That's right. That's uh, where Red Fox And you grew up in St. Louis? Yes, just for maybe two, three uh, years and then got out. So, what football team do you? You don't have to. No, well, you have the I, Cardinals, right? Well, the Cardinals. The, the, it used to be the Rams. The, it, it's now the Rams, but I, I'm not a, a Rams fan because it wasn't the Rams. Right. It, it was so like uh, Los Arizona? Angeles. No, because it was Arizona. Yeah, but they used to I like the St. Louis Cardinals a baseball team. I'm loyal. You have to be with the team. Don't sell out. So I want, if you're the St. Louis Cardinals baseball team, they've been the St. Louis, well, they used to be, what, the St. Louis Browns back Browns. in the 1800s. Mm -hmm. But, uh, no, I, I stick with the team, and if they sell and go somewhere else, then I won't like them anymore. So you don't go for any team outside of St. Louis? You like the Heat? I like the Miami Dolphins. Oh, but gosh. Oh, gosh. Well, you got to be kidding I, I didn't say they were going to win. No, no, I don't like the. Do I don't like any he Miami team. Like any team here. Well, wait. We're all from. We're from New York. We're from though, New so York. We like, we all, we you, like the junkie teams from New York. Though. If you go to any stadium down here, though, you don't know who the you know who the visiting team is. You don't know who the home team is because everybody's from somewhere else and they root for the. You know, you go to New York, uh, New Jersey. If you're playing the New York Rangers or something, there's more people from New York than there uh, for the, know, the that, Panthers and that, so forth. That must stink to hear all the fans in your own building. Rudy for the other team. That's South Florida. We're the fifth borough. Yeah. <laughs> basically. Well, that's true, basically. But I don't like Miami because when Richard Todd was quarterback. Richard Todd? Yeah. I'm How sure far back are we going? That's going back. Mm -hmm. and Did they, they have played, like black and white film? And they played. They didn't even wear helmets. And Ken, oh. Hose, <laughs> Ken, Ken Hosmer was the coach. And they played here in, in, uh, in Miami. And Miami didn't cover the field. And we had Freeman McNeil was the running back. Okay. And it was nothing but a giant pod of mud so he got maybe four yards he was a leading rusher that year in rushing and we went up against miami aj dewey remember him i remember him yes he had an interception they won the game i think it was seven nothing there's been crazy seven, things seven. who was the one who in the snow covered i don't know where they were playing where the the, the guy hit the ball where they were kicking the extra point or something like that oh what was it, it was that's gotta be the metal nose there was he, he he touched the ball, so they had to re-kick again, and they got it. But it was like uh, a faux pas of sorts. Well, there's always been exciting uh, t games with Miami and the Jets, but uh, but I, I squished the fish. It used to be our biggest. Now it's the uh, Patriots we don't like. Yeah, I can't stand. And, it. Well, yeah, spread the wealth. They've been in t too many times. But that's what happens, you know. Well, they they also cheated, so I don't like that. Yeah, but when teams buy too much talent, like I know the Yankees are guilty of this too. I can't stand the Yankees. Yeah, Bobby, Bobby Mercer took my glove. Never gave it back. That was it. I watched my hand. <laughs> He's been was scarred. Eight. Well, let, I was eight let, years let, old. All the New York teams have money. Let's just let's put it this way: the Yankees invest better. Than the Mets do. Well, they're better businessmen. Uh, well, I wouldn't. Yeah, I would go as far to say they're better. Yeah, tell you something. The a, Baltimore a Orioles used to be some team when they had Earl Weaver running that organization. They used to win every year. The Orioles were top notch. So now that they're winning a little bit, everybody's surprised. I'm not surprised. They were a good team in the day. The Orioles. Right. Cardinals have always been. Uh, uh, well, competitive what about an even playing field? Uh, what was that movie uh, with Brad Pitt? Um, Moneyball. Uh, Moneyball. Did you yeah. see that? Well, yes, that, was, I did. that was with uh, uh, with the A's, right? Yeah, but that, that was a true story. story. Yeah, yeah, yes, it's, 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 went but on they never won. No, it wasn't. But they got but to it, where they got with no money. Invested. Yeah, but you, <laughs> you, you can't numbers. you can't win the the big one without having a you know a real well, team. Well, they're buying a championship. Yeah. Uh, go back to LeBron well, James. No, no, they're, buy, they're buying a, a small team championship. They're a small market. But they were competing against the Yankees yes, and the Red Sox. But they they couldn't finish it because they didn't have the, the caliber teams you needed in the playoffs, and that was it. They can't win the big one. Well, there's a there's an old saying that the season is just a tune up for the playoffs. So exactly. the playoffs is really what your money buys. You. The Heat better win tonight. It's all on them tonight. All the well, money is on them. One championship. They proven that they can, they it can do it. It doesn't matter. You got the greatest show on earth right now. Game that. seven, yes. And that team, you know, everybody either loves or hates the Heat. Yeah, the, okay. you can't. You well, either love them or you hate them. You can't be in between. Now I got a question for you. Do what do you do to sign the your famous three? Next year, there are no famous three. I, I have mean, LeBron. You're, you're the three. other two aren't so famous anymore. Yeah, they're, they're not, not a, a caliber like LeBron. So you're gonna get rid of him? You're not gonna sign Wade. Wade is the Heat. Yeah, but Wade's hurt, and you don't know how, if he's able to come back. Do from you? It? You know, like I think Wade. You can't Riley's him, gonna Bosch. sign. Mm, yeah. Oh, now Bosch is the culprit. You, you could. Yeah, he didn't show up. 
Who do you, he saved so many games for when LeBron and Wade have have been in there. I mean, Bosh, he's not a he's not a superstar. Like LeBron he does do a lot. He he gets rebounds. He he shoots the three once in a while, which is surprising. You don't want actually, him to, and he Bosch may be it. your secret weapon tonight. Yeah, ba- Bosh is a bad player. He may be the one to pull this game out for you. If guys. we took calls from Cleveland, what do you think they'd be talking about? Uh, hey, you heard what LeBron said? He said uh, it was just was like it, was it English? English? Yeah, he said, he said he felt like he was playing in Cleveland again. Oh, okay. <laughs> How do you like that smack? No. I thought they're supposed to be role models and and this the, is the ba- this is championship basketball, baby. They ain't no role models. Sound like my grandfather. Well, but that's the truth. That's what it is. The integrity of the game, not going after the money. You sh- I mean, I I want fairness. I wanted to. So be you want him to take a pay cut for the other t- for the rest of his team? You want and like, like one like, salary? Like all right. So not Wade Wade took drastic. a pay cut. LeBron and Bosch could come. And then the rest of the team, they're on minimum you salary. Don't think there should be some caps somewhere or yeah. some control. I don't think you should ha- have anybody have that kind of of authority to swing everything in one direction. I think the commissioner should have stepped in and stopped that. Tr- that well, deal. now they have that. That he can do. Yeah, it now. they did it one year too late. You can't do that now. You got to get approval. Now. Oh, okay, but you can't. It couldn't be done at that moment. So they learned their lesson the first time, and now it can't be done really. Well, I just hope that the Knicks pick up uh, what you want to call it from the Hornets, and then uh, they can get Dwight Howard. I want I want him to get um, what's his name from uh, the Clippers. We the are no guard. different. We're just jealous that the Knicks don't win. No, like I, the I, Heat. I, I want <laughs> Jason, Jason Kidd. It, it, it's That's called all it is, Jason baby. Kidd is staying. Is, this He's is staying. He's I'm staying. I'm buying him some crutches, man. And, and I, I want uh, Chris Paul. It's all how you could market it. Uh, who's the guy with the the Dallas Mavericks or whatnot? Who's Cuban. A, okay, he's, he's honest. He'll tell you right up front. He's honest. He yeah, says he does show Shark Tank. Yeah, it's all about him. The show is about but, him. But listen, this is the guy who you know how he made his money. No, his fortune. He used to sell on uh, those uh, uh, on the uh, on your beeper scores and be you know pro sports. Oh, he, he sold that to bankers for billions. Oh, okay. And when he took his money, he bought this huge house. He had no furniture. He had a basketball court. He says, I'm going to buy a team. That's what, what he did. Boy, is that the American way? Well, now he thinks he's all that. Because well, he invented one thing. He's running the show now. It, but he invented one thing. That's all it takes. But you know something? I wish that Cuban was the Knicks owner. Or I wish Cuban was the Mets owner because he puts money up to win. But he right. tells you, listen, I'm going to pay you. <laughs> but you got to What about Magic Johnson? What about Magic? When he, uh, he bought that team. The, the Dodgers. Dodgers. Did he you put, see? He threw money into he that team. He threw his life into that team. And there's a lot of money going through the Dodgers. And it was successful for a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> it pushed them through. Well, so it's all about money, right? It's all about it money. It makes the, money, the world go around. Right? You, you see, when money. you hit Lotto, buy the Marlins. Well, I wouldn't it, buy the Marlins. Isn't it harder to <laughs> make your first million rather than putting a million to make another million? What's harder, making, making that Making your first million. Yeah, okay. So if you have all that money that you can throw in, you're buying a championship, you're buying a ring. But then it's sad. I keep thinking, who had the birthday? Um who used to be with the Dolphins, the quarterback. Dan Marino. Marino. Dan Marino just had a birthday, but yet he doesn't have um, a ring. Isn't that sad? Put Gio on. Mr. Gio, are you Gio. there? Yeah. How do you, what do you think, who do you think is going to win tonight? What are my choices? <laughs> the Heat or the Indiana How Pacers? How many Game 7s are out there? Yeah, chocolate or vanilla? What are you ordering here? <laughs> Strawberry. <laughs> what do you say? Strawberry. 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 All right, so we got, we got, we got about three minutes. Predictions, then. Who's going to do what predictions? Well, who do you of got Of course tonight? it's going to be the Heat. You think the Heat went tonight? I Absolutely. Think you think the Heat went tonight? I'm you got to go with the home field advantage. That's you got to go with LeBron. You see, me all the... I'm you ha- it's a game, game seven, the biggest game you got. LeBron's going to throw 60 points up if he has to. He's going to get it done. Heat win. Gio, who do you like? The Heat? And they were in their house. So. And, yeah, I, I like you the can't heat. go against LeBron. Not who do you right like? Now. The Heat. All right. I am well, they f- are favored, you I'm know, of course. Y- y- I'm going for Indiana well, yeah, winning by three. Winning by three. Winning by three. If they win by one, I'll be happy. Well, I don't care. Are points like, in, like you're in Vegas? <laughs> no, no. How but many I, points do you have to give? <laughs> no, but I, I just think that tonight is going to be one of those games. Remember when this kid shot the 29-footer and tied the game in overtime and they lost? That's a game that he should have lost. They should have lost, what was it, uh, in, in game one. 
That was the one. Okay. That was the one. Um, so, okay, so we got uh, majority. Well, let's see what happens. If I win tomorrow, I'll be singing a song. Well, I don't want the Heat to win. I think oh. the Indiana and the, and the San Antonio would be a better Did game. Did somebody guess or, or what? Oh, Gia, how many, how many uh, what is it? Dimples. Dimples on okay, golf ball. Why, does I he play a, golf? That's my I son. I a poll on the live stream, and right now, I'm going to go ahead and say 300 to 500. 300 to 500. Well, yeah. it's in that range. Yeah, well, it's yes. in that range. Oh, I'm number. sorry. Can you, can you? I need a number. 314, you want, you want 32. Exact number? Get, get, I'm gonna get, like, close. Yeah, the exact number. 450. 450? He, he's, he's very close. Well, he All also right. has a computer. So firm, should, I give, should I give the gift certificate to you? Okay, no, no. Give it to me and I'll give it to him. Don't worry. Now, if we were playing Price is Right rules, you're, you're over. I want, I want 449. <laughs> <laughs> no, too high. All right, the answer is about 420. Oh, I, I win. I was surprised. Right. <laughs> 420. Yeah. 420. Now, there are some that are a little bit less, but on average is about 400, 420. Well, listen, we're going to invite you to the Why club. do I know that? Because I don't, I, I don't that, play golf. We're going to invite you to the golf club. To the golf to The, the driving range? No, no, to the club. And we're gonna, of balls. And we're going to play a little bit of golf. Don't it's I not, have to know? Not miniature. No, we'll show you everything you need to know. And you'll learn golf in 15 I minutes. I can't afford the clubs. I'm in radio. Don't worry. We got clubs. <laughs> <laughs> we got, have you ever seen? We got, we got clubs for you. But okay. we have to say goodbye. We'll, cause we'll, we'll make you clubs. I have a hoe is over. <laughs> can't even putt. Tonight's <laughs> sports talk. Watch Alan Knight and Doris Day. Bridget Day. Bridget <laughs> no. Day on Wednesday, 7 to 8. We'll see you guys next week. And uh, let's go Pacers. You've been listening to Santori and Sons, the show where society's past, present, and future are viewed and explained through the eyes of three different age mindsets. Remember, you can view the show at amp2.tv and tune in again next time here on WNN for more.